I'm Danielle Barrios O'Neill, and I'm the head of program for information experience design at the RCA. Information experience design is about the communication of complex information, complex ideas through the design of artworks that are actively experienced, so not just looked at. This might be, for example, an installation or a game or a VR experience, with the central thing being that you're generating an active encounter with a complex subject. One thing to know about ID, especially in relation to other programs, is that it's a method rather than a discipline. What I mean by that is we don't teach you a way of making. We teach you a way of making your own way of making. How you develop your ways of asking questions and how you identify the things that really interest you, how you dig down for the root, and fundamentally how you then use that to build a structure that works for what you want to do. One reason why we do this is because the world that we operate in as um, artists, designers, researchers is constantly changing. And so the right questions to ask are going to be changing all the time as well. Many graduates of IED and students of IED go on to do really big things. And this is partly because we think, because the way that we approach art and design practice is so unique. Our applicants come from lots of different disciplines, from of course practicing artists and, and people running studios, as well as working for corporations, commercial organizations, starting their own companies, all sorts of things in lots of different areas. For us as the educators, we think about that as, as one of the most exciting challenges that we have. And the way that we approach it is to constantly be responding to what our cohorts need, what their interests are, and what's happening in the world around that we can respond to. To be a student of ID, you need to be curious and adventurous in terms of being willing to try new things, but also to be okay with failure, to get comfortable with a really important part of the creative process. And that originality and things that are truly extraordinary come from a lot of failure. Most IED students are up for collaboration, sometimes in sort of unique and interesting ways. And we hope that you are because working sort of as part of an ecosystem is, is a really important way to understand the role of the artist and, and also the role of, of art and design itself. Students are constantly breaking the boundaries of, of what's thought to be worthwhile within the domain of the arts. So you might find yourself working on a project that seems you wouldn't have even thought of it as being art and design. And some of these approaches lead to some of the most interesting and exciting work. It's a challenging program. We want students who want to be challenged. That process of embracing risk and crossing boundaries and working across media and forming your own way of working, all of that is really challenging. And we teach it in a way that is designed to support you, but also to put you in situations that may not always feel like your comfort zone. And we feel like that's a good thing.